Hey, this is JC here at JC's Comics and More, your pop culture superstore at 6725 West Central Avenue. That is Toledo, Ohio, 4361741-531-6097. Uh, JC's Comics and More at Hotmail, and you can find the Facebook information in the description below. Uh, going through some stuff in the storage units, and I knew I had figures in there. Pulled out a whole lot of figures that I've not had in my store in a long, long time. I've got to price these things up, so it's going to take a little bit of time. But here's some of what I have. Series 7 of the Alex Ross Justice League series. We've got Supergirl. Yeah, you'd like to buy that for $16.99. Sorry, that is not that price any longer. Not for a long time. Captain Cold. Got Dark Victory, Tim Sale. Got the Batman figure from Dark Victory. Got from DC Direct, Shazam with the Evil Mr. Mind. And again, you would like to pay $16.99, but it's not going to be that. This came out in 2002, 19 years ago. The Shazam uh, line of figures. Captain Marvel Jr. Mary Marvel, which actually looks a little bit like, was it Kate Beckinsale from uh, the uh, Underworld uh, movies uh, there. You've got Green Lantern action figures, Series 1, Hal Jordan. Some of the Blackest Night, Series 2, John Stewart. Black Lantern, Martian Manhunter. And then you got the Indigo Lantern. I'm going to pause and we'll get a new group of figures over here. Okay, this one here, WWF. I thought this was uh, the first one I was pulling out. It's cool. Got a Stone Cold figure. Now it is the uh, Shawn Michaels. And really, really uh, roided out Shawn Michaels there. Official Federation Sweat with sweat pumping action. Maximum sweat. And he has a metal chair to beat you over the head with. But that was the other figures in um, in that line. You had the Undertaker uh, with breakaway 2x4, the rock with the ladder, Kane with the crate of dynamite, Stone Cold with the sledgehammer, Sean with the foot-up chair, Triple H with the trash can. Then you had Breakdown. There was another line from back then with X-Pac. Draws. I think he's dead. Uh, Stone Cold Steve Austin. Mankind. D-Lo Brown. Goad Dust. You got Too Tough for you. The Rock versus Corporate Mankind. Undertaker versus Kane. Big Boss Man versus Stone Cold Steve Austin. Van Venus, Val Venus versus B.A. Billy Gunn, Brawl for All, and Lethal Ladder Match, Deadly Dungeon Championship Belts. These came out in 1999 from Jack Specific. Okay, lots of Spider-Man figures. Again, I've got to get these, do some research, get these up. This is the Sneak Attack Spider-Man, Web Flyers, Copter Spider-Man. Let's see, when did these come out? Those came out in 1997, so that's what, 24 years ago, these figures are. Vintage! Magnetic Spider-Man, he's uh, globbed uh, J. Jonah Jameson with some webbing on his, on his uh, phone. You got Web Splasher Spider-Man, inflatable floating accessory. You got Spider Crawling Spider-Man, authentic crawling action. Web Flyers with Steel Spider Flyer. That's a sneak attack. It's another sneak attack. Hobgoblin with Pumpkin, go pumpkin Bomb Flyer. And I've got some of the original Violators from not McFarlane Toys. This was from Todd's Toys. This was when it was Todd's Toys. And this is from 1994. So this is what, uh, 
27, 27 years ago. This is 27 years old. Uh, this action figure here is. Um, so we've got that. I challenge any shop in the area to have even 5% of what I have here. Here we've got Star Trek Nemesis, Viceroy. We've got some of the uh, the Tubby Bitch Lunchbox, Kevin Smith Clerks animated figures and action figures, Brody. You got Wilhelm, always searching for his sailboat forever and ever. Randall, no time for love, Dr. Jones. You got Jay peddling his goods. He's got a fatty all rolled up for you. There you go. There he is. There's Fly, Fat Ass Fly. Kevin Smith himself. Clerks in action figures. And on the back, they've got little info about them. This is from Big Blast. Which was, uh, I think Big Blast was part of Graffiti. Yeah, Graffiti way back then. They actually did more than just t-shirts. They actually did did some uh, actual action figures. Now this here, uh, from Rendation, uh, Widow, which is also part of Avatar. This is, uh, gosh, what the hell is his name? Mike? Oh... Mike Woofer, that's who did this. Mike Woofer, here's a here's a figure here. Again, I guarantee you're not going to find in probably 50 out of, uh, uh, go to 50 different comic shops, you probably would not find this figure. This is from 1998. You'll find it here at JC's Comics and More, your pop culture superstore. That's why uh, I've got lots of imitators, uh, but few that can actually truly compete. Got some of the NFL figures. This is Series 13. Teddy Bruschi. Uh, hard to believe uh, that he had a stroke many years ago. A few other NFL action figures. There you go. Randy Moss when he was a Oakland Raider. They did beat the Dallas Cowboys that year, I'm sad to say. Well, here's another Spider-Man figure. The Super Stunt Spider-Man. And these figures here, these are just ones I pulled out really quickly. Uh, there's other figures I have too <coughs> that I I'm just pull, I just went through boxes and just pulled these out. Yeah, I need this. I need this. I need this. I was in a big hurry to do other stuff. Here's a darkness figure from uh, more action collectibles. Uh, this came out in 2001. This thing's 20 years old and brand freaking new never been molested by anybody here we got larry johnson that's nfl series 14 a kansas city chief unfortunately he never won a super bowl uh that's when the chiefs were good but just not good enough Let's see who else do we have we got a from the seattle seahawks they won a super bowl but not with sean alexander uh it's really crazy. This dude here, he was an MVP in the league or, uh, uh, for uh, rushing yards. Next year, he was a total bust. Lost it. Just just, just totally lost it. Uh, more Spider-Man. Another Spider-Man. This is Rocket Blast Spider-Man. Almost looks like uh, this was based on uh, the Scarlet Spider. See how he's got the, uh, he's got the hoodie on. All right, Total Justice. This was from Kenner, Aquaman with blasting hydro spear. He's got the uh, he's got the uh, harpoon hand. This is from 1996. So again, that's a uh, uh, 25 years old. Never been out of the box. From the the now. Defunct Chaos Comics, Brian Polito's Chaos Comics. We've got Lady Death. This is sculpted by Clayburn Moore. She's got stacked with her stored. 
sword. She's ready to do business. Um, and this came out in 1997. And also we've got Lady Demon. Uh, this Lady Demon looks like her horn. Her horn got busted off, so this is a battle damaged Lady Demon. So we've got those that are going to be available for sale. These here are special too. These are really special. This is from uh, Toy Biz. This was some of the first Builder figure waves. I got Beta Ray Bill. This is the very first Beta Ray Bill action figure. And then it uh, collect all six Modocs to build your own Modoc. And he's got the uh, the flaming fart uh, cloud coming out that you get with this one here. Uh, so you can see it right there. And that's the cloud. And then you see it, the rest of it underneath there. Also in this line was Spider Woman, Captain Marvel, the Captain Marvel, Moon Knight, uh, Thor, Buster Iron Man, the Wasp. What other ones do I have, you say? And also it comes with a collectible reprint of Thor 337. I think that thing is actually worth something these days. Comes with, uh, here's Spider Woman. Uh, and this comes with a reprint of Spider-Woman number one. And again, I think these things are worth something. She comes with Modoc's head. Look at him. Only a uh, face a mother could love. Of course, the mother has to be blind uh, to love this face because if she could see it, she would want no part of business with that. And we've got Hulkbuster Iron Man. He comes with uh, Modoc's uh, right arm detachable face mask I thought we had a wasp one also maybe not I could swore I had wasp but maybe not we'll move on to these next if I don't I know I've got one I'll just have to next time I go through those boxes I'll have to bring it in here here was the light up weapon series uh, from the Marvel classics you had Wolverine uh, light up plasma weapon he was uh, in a much different a purple and uh, not quite blue. I'm not sure if you call that navy blue uh, costume. Batteries included. I wonder if those batteries still work. You can see they've not they've not melted out. But we got that there. I can't recall who did that artwork. But we also do have, and this is this is pretty damn nice. Except he's got he's got such a wee little head. The juggernaut. Look at him. He's got a wee little head. Dude can't even, you know, his head's so small, he can't even pick his nose. Hell, he can't even, uh, can't even rub his eye or anything. If he, you know, if he didn't watch it, uh, as he goes to uh, pick his nose or something, might uh, bust his face right off of there. But the light up weapon, light up jewel weapon. And these came out, I think that's Mark Bagley. I am pretty damn sure that is. That's Mark Bagley artwork. Uh, these came out in 96, so these are 25 years old, so early Mark Bagley artwork there. Okay. They're coming to Toledo on August 25th, which is Gene Simmons' birthday and also somebody else's birthday I know of also. Uh, the Kiss Creatures line from McFarlane Toys. Here is Paul Stanley, the Star Child. Let's see, what year did these come out? These things came out in 2002. How you doing today? So we've got, we've got Paul. We've got Gene Simmons, the demon. Look at him. He's got his axe base. And I've got a couple of those. And there she is. There's the wasp. I thought I, I knew I had brought the wasp. She's got a really bad haircut. A really bad costume, too. That was a really bad choice to give her a costume. But she's got Modoc's uh, 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 torso and legs. So she's got, got the good stuff there. She can help unlock the key there and uh, change his diaper. It's so 26 points of articulation. Uh, what are the other ones? Iron Man's 34. 26 for Spider-Woman. 32 for Beta Ray Bill. That's when they used to like to brag about how many points of articulation they had. That was always a big selling point. We're going to pause again. This here is the JLA Series 2 assortment. 
And we're just looking here real quick. Uh, I think these were all artwork by um, uh, Alex Ross, or I think this is the Justice. I think they say Justice League, but it's the Justice. This is a unopened, well, it was an unopened case. I'm going to pull these out, but I'm going to pause. Okay, this is Series 2. We're getting Alex Ross. We've got Aquaman. The detail is pretty exquisite on these. We've got the Parasite. Batman. This doesn't look right seeing Batman's eyes. But that's how Alex envisioned them. Here we got the Black Canary with actual uh, fish nets. Very, very hot. And then Black Manta. Oh, this is so cool. I'll uh, let you guys that are watching from out of state, I do mail orders. I know a guy in St. Louis is probably gonna, gonna call me up about that Black Manta, but I don't know what the prices are gonna be yet, so I gotta do some research on these things. Uh, who knows what these things are going for? Uh, especially, we've got Days of Future Past Wolverine with him and Kitty Pride. And it looks, uh, Kitty Pride almost looks like the girl from Stranger Things and Godzilla. Uh, what's her name? Millie Vanilli. Uh, so it looks like her a little bit. Uh, and then these things I know are going for decent, really decent money. Zombie Spider-Man. He's got his leg. He's going to take his leg off and beat you. He's got the Headless Silver Surfer as the base. This came out way back in 2007. There was Colonel Captain America and Zombie Hulk. We do not have the Colonel Captain America currently but I do have the Zombie Hulk with the headless uh, Silver Surfer's decapitated head. If you do like these videos, as always, make sure you do subscribe to the channel. Uh, when you do the subscribe, be sure to smash the bell for notifications. Be sure to like, be sure to share, be sure to comment. Thanks for watching. And again, we do mail order. And uh, once I get these things priced up, they might go very, very fast. Thanks again for watching.